arrange drawing inside layout. Already you know how to arrange drawing inside layout. If you don't know, please go to layout section. You will get it clear lecture. Now I go to the layout one and right click, go to the page setup manager and make it new setup one if you want you can make rename also i just simply setup one select here drawing to pdf and i select here a3 420 into 297 iso full bleed p3 so i select this one and keep as it is i need always black and white so i select this monochrome and other all the thing keep as it is and simply ok and select this one set current and close it now we don't want this view i just delete it now we need to place our drawing sheet already we prepared a title block a3 in title block lecture this one we prepared same thing i just copy and i am going to use it that place for that control shift c in your keyboard and I click this corner, select this one, enter. And I go to the project, control V, 0, comma, 0, enter. Now it is placed exactly inside. If you go to control P, or if you go to the print, and other all the thing, it is perfect. Go to the preview, you can see your sheet is perfectly visible. Now we can keep inside this drawing sheet our view for that go to layout and go to the rectangle here it is rectangle viewport we need to create and i just click this corner and i click this corner okay now all the views come inside but i am going to place this one only this plan view. so i just make like this and double click outside actually this one Already I checked. If you want, you can all you also can check. If you click here, you will get it some default scale available. Okay, if you place 100, it is coming very big. Okay, so more than 100, you need to place it. So more than 100, it is not available. But in this case, already I checked so to 275 scale, it will fix properly. So just go to the model and go here, go to the custom, go to add, one is to 275, okay, then make it 275 and okay and close and go to the layout one, select this one, click here, make it 275, see here 275 exactly we can place inside this one okay. it's also a little bit okay but it's okay. okay now if you don't want this much detail just you can delete and throw that also and select this one click here and you can place inside like this just place like this so now this is the plan view we placed our plan view inside layout one so now go to the next layout to two for that we need this drawing sheet so control shift c and i just click here select this drawing sheet enter now go to the layout one layout two and select this one we don't want this one and this also page setup we need to change before that just go to the control v zero comma zero enter but you can see here this dotted line it is showing here like this if you print means your sheet never get it full i just show you if you go to the print and if you go to the preview you can see this much only you will get it because the printable area it is inside your drawing sheet outside the printable area so we need to make this one big for that go to the page setup manager select this one set current okay and just select this one and close it so when you operate new 
it will automatically update now go to the layout make it rectangle and i just click here and i just click here this one we are going to place this elevation view. double click and just you can place it if you don't know uh, how to make this kind of things just go to the layout session you will get it clear lecture and i just select this one and this one we need to make it a different scale if you place this 275 it will show very small but i checked 175 scale is comfortable so i just go to the model and just go here go to the custom add one is to 175 scale and make it 175 and ok and close go to the layout tool and select this one and click here make it 175 this is one method if you uh, without going uh, to model and if you don't want to update here the scale without updating also you can make that one select this one go to the properties and here you can see here custom scale available if you select this one one slash 175 enter see here nothing changed because it is the same scale one slash 100 means you can see if you want to change the custom scale you can change here also or you can just select or you can just select this one and you can select here also okay if you made inside this model the same scale it is available here if it is not available here you can use this custom scale or you can select here okay so now it is fine and this is okay i just click this point and i just click this point and place it here just crop and place it and i just click inside and place it like this so now it is ready we need to make another one more elevation view this is actually installation but we have another one uh, that is this one this is okay this is actually unloading one okay this is we need to actually we need to place it next to right this one this is unloading one unloading position this is unloading position and the next one is we need to place it installing one so for that i just click here new layout is added here and i click here and select this one we need to set up this one and set correct and close it and now we need no don't want just delete it and go to the drawing sheet just go here control shift to c just click here select the drawing sheet enter and go to the third one and control v zero comma zero enter now it is placed exactly inside the printable area now go to layout go to the rectangle and i just click this point and i click this point actually we need to place this one this is the installing position just make it like this double click outside and just click here, here and i click here already we added 175 scale that scale is more than enough so just click here again we need to crop select this one just crop like this just crop and place it like this so now it is ready the third layout also ready now we need to add the rigging plan for that just click here and here it is added and select this one select here set current and close it now we don't want this one delete it now go to the rectangle before creating rectangle already we copied the drawing sheet so just simply control v 0 comma 0 enter now go to the rectangle just click this corner and i just click this corner and double click here we need to place it this one okay this one our rigging plan so the rigging plan we used 30 scale that is comfortable scale if you made 30 scale you can place it here inside see here available 30 scale so it is comfortably placed inside it just click here and place it like this now go to the first layout we need to make the changes use this uh, same job number drawing number and drawing number if you want to change you can make the changes actually this is lifting plan so make a lift okay. lift zero one and okay. and this is the project lifting project 
plain looking wall. Okay, and next one, this is the title, drawing title. This drawing actually plan B. Okay, just double click here. Crane lifting plan B. Okay, and simply okay. Now this is scale. Actually, this scale also you can change. This scale actually we used in this 275. One is to 275. So you can make one is to 275. And here we used four sheets. So you can make one of four. Okay. Then we can make a revision and all. That is, we will do it. Okay. Other all the thing capacities. Then now go to the next sheet. Next sheet also we need to make here. We need to make lift. Okay. And this is the second drawing. So just make it two. And this is the project we used here. Just double click and copy that one and go to the next sheet this is the project double click and paste it repeat the same in next sheet also just double click and paste it go to the next sheet and repeat the same okay. same thing we can make this uh, the drawing number also actually here we used lift like this just copy and go to the next sheet and double click already it is perfect no need to change also right change it no problem just go to the third one double click control v and make it this third one okay now go to the fourth one double click control v make it this is the fourth number it is okay now we need to make the title also go to the second sheet this is lifting plan elevation okay so lifting plan crane lifting plan Elevation view. Just make it EL. EL view. Okay. And if you want to show this is the unloading or installing. So like that if you need you can use that, uh, that also. I just don't want. I just copy this one. And okay. Now go to the layout 3. Make it this also the same title. Okay. This is the elevation view. And the next one is rigging. So select this double click here and just paste it. Crane lifting rigging plan. Rigging plan. And just if you need to make the scale also, you can make the scale. And here the sheet. This is the 4. And here it is 2. Okay. Then the scale this one. Actually 1 is to 175 and okay. Now go to the third sheet. This also. This is the third sheet. Make it third and total sheet is 4 and okay. Then the scale is 1 is to 175 and okay. Now everything is ready. Fourth sheet also. Fourth sheet. This is the 4 of 4. Okay, make it 4 and here it is 4. This one scale is 1 is to 30. Okay. So now everything is ready. We arranged all the drawing inside layout. So this is the way you need to arrange all the rigging drawing inside a layout in drawing sheets.